so much for joining me today. So the idea of this interview is that my company, Energy Rise, I want to bring uh, mindfulness and as many different techniques as possible to um, as wide an audience as I can reach. Uh, some people just jump straight into the experience and I feel that some people need to understand the workings of the brain and the benefits of what's happening when they do their mindfulness practice. Um, so for the audience, I'm joined by Tamara Russell, who is a clinical psychologist, a martial artist, and a neuroscientist. Wait. Wait. So what we're doing here now is we're doing a Tai Chi move called Wave Hands Like Clouds. And this is a way that I like to show how we can gently bring the mind. So when we're in stage three, the place where we notice that the mind has wandered, we think about wave hands like clouds and we say, come on mind, let's come back, nice and soft, no need to rush, but we're going to get back to the breath or where we want it to be. And this is maybe distinct then from let's try on the next one where we need to be a bit firmer, so we go into a Kung Fu block. Boom! 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 Yeah, boom, that's it! Go! One's a mirror, one's down. Yeah, so this is more firm. Bring the mind back. Come on, mind! Stop mucking around! <laughs> Sometimes we need soft, gentle. Come on, mind, try your best. Let's go. Sometimes we need the firm. No, mind, not now. I see you going over there, and I'm more firmly bringing you back. It's kind of amazing that you actually, it's a lot harder for the mind to even start wondering, I, I find, when there's movement, because you're so concentrated on the movement. But then are you concentrating on the movement, or is you, are you thinking the movement, as you said before? It's... Well, let's try and see. So, there is some thinking that's required to learn, and to just copy and mimic, of course. But here, you can notice with this move that you could choose where to focus attention. So you could choose to focus attention just on the weight through the feet, actually, and the shifting from left to right. Being really interested in the feet, and maybe the knees, or even just the lower half of the body, way, way. Focused attention on the lower half of the body. One or two goes. And the sensations. What's unfolding? Now. Now. And now. And then I might shift to come up to the waist and see like, okay, waist and torso. Now I'm interested in waist and torso. Sensation of the turning, the twisting. Maybe there's some sensation of clothes, through the lower back, shoulders, into the arms and the fingers, softening as you go, sensing the body, before naming, dropping awareness into the body. And if you see any judging or comparing monkeys coming out, give them a big hug. Mwah, kisses, I love you. Mm. There's my perfectionist monkey wanting to do it in the perfect way. It's like you read my mind there. Mm. <laughs> so sometimes I even say, like, let's just get it really, really wrong. I want you to get it, like, super wrong and just get over the fear of super wrongness. And make all kinds of moves and then say, it really, you know, I'm not teaching this to you for martial application, even though there is a martial application of this. We're just moving the body mindfully. So you really don't need to get it right. But isn't it curious? We want to do it perfect. Yeah. We think everybody, oh, she looks so good. And this yoga trousers, I need to be like that. No, you just need to be you. Mm -hmm. Just need to be you. You're playing with the body and you're just seeing. What I love about Tai Chi is, I mean, it's kind of like the lazy man's thing. It's like, what is the posture 
I am making these kind of micro adjustments just to see like what just feels easy. <laughs> this is the, the, the Taoist way. What, what feels easy? What would just let my body float? And it's the micro adjustments through the legs and the waist allow us to go deep into the body. Relax the face. Let's do two more. Thinking about the learning styles, again, if you ask somebody to do this who's in a bit of a stress and just come from a nightmare meeting, they want to meet you here. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so it's the same thing, but we go with a bit more energy and we say, yes, come on, get into it, no problem, Whoa, firmness. But now let's play. Yeah, so you've got the range. Some people, if you just go into the slow movement, they want to like throttle you. Yeah. So you need to have that flexibility, mm -hmm. and I think the movement gives us that, the pacing, the intentionality, the firmness, the tightness. And yoga does some of that, of course, too, working with the toners. Yeah. Amazing. Thank you. <laughs>